It was early on in uh, my family's experience with mental illness. I had a loved one who uh, experienced a psychosis, and this led to one thing and to another, and uh, it mostly led to a maelstrom of angst and pain and difficulty. And uh, I was referred to NAMI by, I think it was a clinician, who suggested that uh, it is uh, a premier support organization for families and individuals that are in the maelstrom of mental illness. And I was fortunate to find them early on because uh, it was first through IFSS, one of the programs uh, offered together with NAMI at NAMI's office, uh, a, a, uh, an outreach of support to families. And then shortly after that, I got involved and was enrolled in the Family to Family Psychoeducation course. So uh, that was about five years ago. All right, the walk is um, a critical part of the NAMI cycle yearly in terms of uh, what it does for increasing awareness, but also what it does for uh, shoring up the support both morally and financially for the NAMI organizations right across the country. We're blessed in Mercer to have a, a strong NAMI that helps to coordinate and, and can achieve a very good outreach and an outpouring uh, of support and turn out, as it were. Uh, what I hope for the walk is, first of all, uh, as many people to participate as possible. Just the participation is the initial uh, and in some ways the most important aspect because it signals support it helps to increase awareness. It helps to reduce stigma. And then um, my other hope is that, uh, particularly in these important times, uh, we are uh, wanting to achieve more sustainability, indeed uh, attain sustainability as an important nonprofit organization working in a very important cause. So to the extent that community members can support us financially by either participating in the walk and subscribing as members of the walk or supporting those who might walk on their behalf, uh, this is very important um, to uh, not only uh, the success of what NAMI is trying to achieve publicly, but certainly in terms of sustaining the organization and its ability to maintain and in indeed expand this important mission. Well, the motto for the walk is changing minds one step at a time. And uh, it means a lot to me because uh, this is a long uh, course, a long journey. As they say in Chinese, right, uh, a 10,000-mile journey begins with the first step. We must take such small steps and build them up to 10,000 steps. It's like uh, landing on the moon as well, right? This is one small step for man, but this, what we are trying to achieve right here uh, at home is a giant leap forward for uh, the care and well-being of people and, uh, with mental illness and their families. So um, it's a wonderful metaphor. It's not only a wonderful action representing all that we want to do, marching forward together in a movement. It's a wonderful metaphor about the steps that we need to take step by step uh, on a long journey together in solidarity towards a better future. I'm looking forward to being present for the walk, and I'm looking forward to having my friends join me in the walk and finding many new friends and supporters uh, in the walk for the ultimate walk, the ultimate march towards a better future for uh, those uh, with psychiatric disabilities and indeed their families.